44-year-old Ola Kolemainen, Finnish photographic artist and member of the group known as the Helsinki School, is known for his huge minimalist blow-ups of architectural details from building facades. Now a collection of pictures of these monumental works has been issued. Kolemainen is a perfectionist. He takes up to 500 test photos for each large work, and he was just as painstaking. I think it's really important to be here. And I, I just heard about an, one book that when the artist didn't come over here, uh, they had to print it second time. German publishing house Hatje Kanz specializes in high quality illustrated books. In producing them, the company works closely with the artists whose works they feature. Even the choice of paper it's to be printed on is a joint decision. Mega gloss. That's, that's more or less the paper we need. This is for the cover? No, that's for the content. Content. After the paper and format have been chosen, a dummy of the cover is agreed upon. For the title picture, Kolomainen has chosen an abstract photograph of the Bullring Shopping Center in Birmingham. Kolomainen rediscovers architecture through his photographs. He produces just 25 pictures a year. The publishers wanted the book to reflect his artistic values. Getting the idea successfully onto the printed page involves choosing materials, formatting, editing, writing and translating the text. Then there's what's still called a final blue line proof, although nowadays it's a digital plot that everyone has to approve. And then using all this digital information we expose the plates, which are then hung in the machine. Then something of a miracle takes place. All this digital information becomes an analog image again on paper. An hour passes before a proof page of the book is printed in the right colors. For the photographer, it's a tense time. His opinion is essential because he knows best what colors he originally used. A number of test runs are necessary to get the plates exposed properly. An additional layer of special lacquer provides the photograph's distinctive high gloss. I have no reference, only in the model print, the proof or my original. So, so, and then my way of seeing the colors. So there, I have to see it, not anyone, not someone else can decide it for me. A whole team of graphic designers, writers, and printers have been working on the book. Hatyukans sets great store by sophisticated design, so in coordination with the artist, a specific typography is developed. I'd say what's special about this book is the different kinds of paper we've used. The book pages with pictures are extremely high gloss paper and we've printed the text on a very translucent paper where the type shows through to the other side. The finished book mirrors Ola Kolomainen's own meticulous craftsmanship. In his monumental photographs, reflections on facades become abstract artworks in themselves. The book shows his most recent work and the artist is satisfied with it. The preparation has been worth it. I don't know if I'm proud, but I'm extremely happy. An exhibition of Kolomainen's works will be touring Europe until May 2010. 2,500 copies of the book are already in stores around the world. My future plan is just to continue to make new works. I have already studied pictures from uh, München and then start a new search for new locations. The photographs can now be seen in their original size in Wolfsburg and Helsinki. 
before they go on to Denmark and Britain. <laughs>